You have enemies using hypnosis and the science of the mind against you. Practice psychic self-defense. Put God first, and protect yourself from evil people. Sit quietly and think, lead me, O Lord, in thy righteousness because of my enemies, make thy way straight before my face. Think, Nazareel, Oziel, look at the sigil. The sigil is in Hebrew, which reads from right to left. Let your eyes wander around the shapes and forms. At the center black star are, Yohach and Kalach, around the circle are Av, G, Tats, Karastan, Nag Dichesh, Bat, Rats, Tag, Chak Vetna, Yag Lefzok, Shakhatzit, at the very center is the name of God, Yahweh. Now think, arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for thou hast smitten all mine enemies upon the cheekbone, thou hast broken the teeth of the ungodly, the murderer rising with the light killeth the poor and needy, and in the night is as a thief. The eye also of the adulterer waiteth for the twilight, saying, No eye shall see me, and disgisseth his face. In the dark they dig through houses, which they had marked for themselves in the daytime. They know not the light, for the morning is to them even as the shadow of death. If one know them, they are in the terrors of the shadow of death. He is swift as the waters, their portion is cursed in the earth. He beholdeth not the way of the vineyards. Drought and heat consume the snow waters, so doth the grave those which have sinned. The womb shall forget him, the worm shall feed sweetly on him. He shall be no more remembered, and wickedness shall be broken as a tree. He evil entreateth the barren that beareth not, and doeth not good to the widow. He draweth also the mighty with his power, he risseth up, and no man is sure of life. Would you indeed tear up the judgment and declare me guilty so that you may be innocent? Or do you have an arm like God or thunder with a voice like his? Throw away, please, pride and haughtiness and you will put on splendor, glory and honor. Throw away, please, the heat of your wrath and observe every proud man and humble him. And every proud spirit you will smash and you will extinguish the wicked in their places, and hide them all in the dust and cover with ashes. The Leviathan drinks up the Jordan from its banks, and heth that he will get it. When he lifts his eyes, who will restrain him? I the Lord, will turn him back, with a hook in his nose. Will you pull a crocodile with a hook or tie up its tongue with a rope? Will you put a muzzle on his nose and will you pierce his cheek with your chisel? Will he speak gently with you or will he speak with you pleadingly? Will he make a covenant with you or will you handle him as a slave forever? Will you play with him like a bird? And will you bind him with a string for your daughters? Satan's scales cling to one another and no breath passes between them. One holds to another, and they do not separate. His sneezing lights fire between his eyes like the shine of a smoky dawn. Torches come forth out of his mouth. They leap like tongues of fire. From his nostrils smoke goes forth like burning thorn and incense. His breath spews out coals and sparks come out of his mouth. His strength dwells in his neck and vigor springs before him. The folds of his flesh are clinging, molded over him like iron. Remember the battle, for the Lord won, and always wins against Satan and his satanic forces. The Lord taketh pleasure in them that fear him, in those that hope in his mercy. Praise the Lord, O Jerusalem, praise thy God, O Zion, for he hath strengthened the bars of thy gates, he hath blessed thy children within thee, he maketh peace in thy borders, and filleth thee with the finest of the wheat.